No other ID, no insurance, no state residency requirement. To make it as easy as possible to get a booster shot, there is just one requirement. It will be easy. Just show your vaccination card and you'll get a booster. That CDC vaccination card, the slightly larger than wallet sized ticket out of this pandemic. As more employers require vaccines and governments like New York City say proof of vaccination is required to access a range of indoor activities from bars to Broadway. But if your card is missing, how do you add proof of a booster to it? Officially, it is possible to request a replacement COVID vaccination card, but there's no centralized way to do it in Massachusetts. Instead, the state says you have to go to where you received your vaccines. If it was at a mass vaccination site, they pointed us to this web page that wasn't easy to locate where you'll find links and phone numbers. CIC Health, which ran the mass vac sites at Fenway, the Heinz, Gillette, and the Reggie Lewis Center, has a pretty simple online request form to get a replacement card card. Curative, which ran the sites in Danvers, Dartmouth and Springfield, says to call their 800 number. But a rep says they'll only provide a vaccine receipt, not a replacement card. That echoes what CVS told us. No replacement CDC cards from them, but they will give you either a printed record of vaccination or digital proof using a secure QR code like this that you can keep on your phone, something other pharmacies are also adopting. The state says you can also get a printed record of your vaccines from them by notarizing and mailing in this form, but that can take six weeks to be turned around. You could then ask your primary care doctor if they'll give you another CDC card. Mass General Brigham says people who get a booster through their network can get a new CDC card at that time. Places like New York say you don't have to have a CDC card to gain access. Any official proof of vaccination should be accepted. All right, so the bottom line with this, it is not exactly clear just yet how this vaccine proof will work once it fully goes into effect in New York next month.